OG product comes for Roddy Rebel and Bobby Schmerta. It tells a very interesting story. It's your favorite local, especially after all the spoke. Support the real, get rid of the fake, the F you to the industry. How do you fight back? It's simple. All you got to do is just subscribe. Then follow me on Instagram at C-E-D-D-Y-N-A-S-H, one word. Seti Nash, I will follow back like your pictures and all that. What's up with the visionaries? Be leery. Be aware of when people claim something that we don't particularly know if they really that. Now, OG product may be a super gangster and all that and everything, and I'm not here to say that he's not. But, shout out to the homie Spooks Glizzy. You know, y'all can follow him, Spooks underscore Glizzy, uh, 823. And y'all can go run back that video of OG product essentially getting chased out of the hood. Here's the thing, bro. He claimed that there was three real OGs in that whole entire scene. And that Bobby Schmurda basically ratted. Which, where's the paperwork at? And that Roddy Rebel ain't a crip. He basically was programmed in isolation, essentially. Let's say all of this was true, right? And then you call yourself the real OG. Now, I'm not dissing you. Don't, don't take this as no diss. But as a real OG, right? You have to command the room when you walk in the room. You got to run the gang when you run the gang. When disrespect is given to you, you got to handle disrespect with an executionary mindset. Now, I got a bunch of messages, and I'm not going to say who. From people that were concerned about you mentally, bro. So I don't want to bring it to you the way I really want to bring it to you. I want to talk to you man to man. Saying stuff these days ain't enough. If you don't have proof, if you don't have a paperwork, if you don't have visual, if you don't give people links to look at none of this stuff, we don't believe you. Take it how you want to take it. See, we got to start questioning people's proof. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody in the world ever gonna say they chased me off the block. I don't care how many cats is there. I'm about to get jumped. Now, were you smart for getting up out of there? That's possible. Grabbing a trash can and looking like you trying to, you know, push people over the edge. You know, like them old shows where, you know, the American Gladiator where they used to hit people with the things and everything like that. And I'm not calling you a buster or a punk. But I know people that you beef with, bro. And in your shining moment when you could have looked like the toughest dude on earth, you didn't. And for the last week, you kind of been on suicide watch. And I wish you perfect mental health. But, bro, what you doing right now with no proof, you have to shut the hell up. You just have to. Point blank, period. I don't know nothing about you like that. I don't really trust a man with no facial hair anyways, especially not no black one. And that's just a personal thing. Unless you old as hell. Like, shout out to the minister, Louis Farrakhan. But if you ain't NOI without that fresh face cut and stuff like that, bro, or you ain't in the active military or something like that, bro, to me, I can't trust you. No offense to you, bro. Zero offense. So if you holler at me, you get to talking reckless and all that. I'm letting you know this is no disrespect. What I'm asking you is simply this. Where is the paperwork? Where is your proof? Anybody can say anything. I can tell you why I own a dragon and a diamond encrusted house. But until I show you, it don't mean any goddamn thing. So when you make your video dissing me and all that stuff, I still want you to put out the proof. If you got proof, cool. If you don't, then you don't. Because from what we know in the affidavits we seen, them cats is real, bro. So, yeah. Hate on them all you want because that's what it seemed like. But if you really, really, really telling the truth, right hand or whoever in which you believe in, bro, we need to see that. Because like I told y'all before, we seen the link to read up on what Takashi said against Trey White. 
But y'all expect me to keep it real because you know that I will. I do this daily, baby. If you haven't subscribed, you haven't followed me on Instagram for your free follower and a bunch of likes. And if you haven't, if you haven't streamed the music and ask the question, why the hell not? Nightly Nash Podcast, we just dropped our four episodes. That's N-I-G-H-T-L-Y. Hit the space button, then N-A-S-H. All you got to do is Google it or wherever you listen to podcasts. I did this for y'all. We give y'all the insider's mindset. We divulge you straight into what it is that they think and how we do that is easy. We break it down simply for a good 15 minutes per segment. 